Sperm 101. What's a sperm's journey like? It's not known exactly how the sperm find their way to the egg, but only a few healthy sperm find the right route. Many swim off in the wrong direction. Some will perish in the vagina's acidic environment, while others will get trapped in sticky cervical mucus. Most will run out of energy and stop swimming long before they reach the egg. Sperms travel vast distances to reach the egg. The direct distance is only about 10 centimetres. And the sperms don't swim in a straight line, making the distance even further. If we scale the sperm up to the size of a salmon, the trip would be about 70 kilometres. That's more than 40 miles. The sperm that eventually reach the egg have to fight their way through a protective coat of armour. They do this by deploying chemicals contained in their acrosome. Then they use a spike on their head to puncture a hole. The first sperm to make contact inserts its DNA into the egg. After this happens, the egg produces a chemical that makes its surface impenetrable to the other sperm. Of the sperm left over, those that don't run out of energy, some might find their way out of the womb through the cervix. Some may escape into the body cavity until they're destroyed by the woman's body defense systems. If you enjoyed this clip, Feel free to follow the links on screen for more interesting articles and free courses from the Open University.